All right, let's do this. So we need to W key a Falcon Blade, basically, right? Um, it's a pretty solid start for it too. Did we get this blueberry? Are we gonna need mana generation? I mean, we will. I was thinking we'd just go for a mana orb though. I think a mana orb would just be better than blueberries. So I think I'm gonna skip on the blueberries. Skipping on blueberries, hoping for a mana orb later down. It'll just be better. Um, we should probably get a spear as well. Like we could probably like, cause we're gonna be working on a sword and we might as well have the spear as well. If that's the case, then we're not gonna go with totem. So we don't need this other sword. We can still buy it though, just in case we don't see spear on round one. And I think that's the plan. If we're not going totem, do we need bag of stones then? Probably not. But then again, bag of stones can just help. Right? And it's not that big of a uh, gold waste. Because the stones are just going to sell back for one gold. So, that's what we'll do. We'll buy all three of these. Another stone is pretty nutty. Um, Maybe we'll just buy this garlic just for the survivability and we call that. I didn't have to play. We'll just buy this garlic for the survivability and we'll, we'll just call that. Yeah. Unsell third. A totem build calling. I don't right. I think uh, they may fit with Holy Spear. Great, since it counts as holy. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And bank spots for a spiller. That is very true. That could also be a build. Another one. We don't need another one, though. I think I'm going to... Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, let's just buy all three of these. Just so I can get my economy. Um, a little bit of space is good. I'm gonna go with this. But we do need to see a spear though. So we might need the W key for a spear or something. If I see a broom on sale, I'll buy it. Hoping for a spear though. <laughs> I don't need any of this. Yeah. Okay. I like that. I like the gloves. I like the gloves. Um. I just buy these two, right? One glove down. One more to go. One more to go. We should lose this. I think. Damn, the stones helped a lot. <laughs> Getting the additional damage on those stones helped a lot, actually. Four to five to seven, four to six. That helped a lot. Damn. That's a dragon. I don't want it, though. There's the broom on sale. Hmm. I'm gonna get you. See what happens here. There's the orb. All right, I sell this. And we'll just do this instead. And I think I just buy this space. Reserve orb for next round. Okay. So far, so decent, I guess. That's a burning torch with a freaking broom. And he's got short bone aside. Double beanans as well. That's tough. This is going to be tough. Nah, we lose. We lose. Pretty sure. Yeah. That's okay, though. That's okay. It's the only orb we'll need. I need a spear. Oh, there's a falcon blade. We sell garlic for it, probably. Um, I guess I'll do this. Rainbow Badge trumps most early game. Yeah, it does. It does. Even... I don't know. I don't I don't ever get it because it just destroys your bag or your shop. All those items. It's hard to actually make a build with all those items. Six regeneration? Damn. That's okay. We got Falcon Blade now. Stone skin potion might not be bad for the sake of stone gloves, like you said, but I don't think I'm gonna go stone gloves. That is nice. Where's my spear? Thank you. Okay, 
Bill's looking up. Bill's looking up. Bill is looking up. Let's, um, figure something out here. There we go. This can go... Yeah, it can go anywhere. It's not gonna proc. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. Okay. <laughs> wow. We might lose. Pocket Blade and uh, Spikes is scary. Okay, we still win. <laughs> 9 to 10 damage. 20 damage per hit is nice. Alright, Spear has been acquired. I feel like we should low-key make some space for it, though. I guess we could just put the food situation over here. And that'll make space for it. Nice. And this extra Gloves of Haste? I'm gonna just buy it, just put it down somewhere because i eventually want to turn into a vampiric uh vampiric gloves which i think would be solid sun armor huh man look at it. the armor just got destroyed let's go spear nice good and now we get vampirus which that's gonna help a lot do i even need bag of stones now we really don't i should probably not invest into that don't need anything there. Do I get a corrupted crystal? I actually think I do. Yeah, I think I want this. I'll get this. I wonder if Falcon Blade surrounding by stones could work. Need stamina generation, but that's a lot of empowerment really quickly. What are you gaining empowerment from? Are you talking about just the totems? Oof. Thorns is going to be a problem. Damn, the freaking 30 critical. Um, I'll pass on that. I'll get this, though. I don't need another mana orb. Give me something good, game. Please. <laughs> oh, man. Game hates me. That was not a good round for us. Not a good round. Finally, that was a good round. Okay, we got our Holy Sphere. I don't think I want that. I might just say fucking and get it, honestly. Or do I just W key like vampiric items in uh, oil lamp? Maybe that's what I'll do. I'm not just W key vamp. You know what? Never mind. I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get it. How often do I stream? I stream every day. Whoa. Whoa. Way too dank. I wish I had my Holy Spear now. I could just not care about debuffs. And it also fucks up his uh, his damage. <gasps> you proking is insane. Can I still win? Can I still win? Nope. I just kept missing. <sighs> if only I had Holy Spear this round. God dang it. Okay. Hello, prismatic orb. Where's the vampires? I, I have to get this. I think I get this this round. I might just sell you. I thought I just bought you. I don't really need these two. Maybe I can get rid of five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Maybe nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Blah blah blah. Is it too early to sell piggies? I keep this for the survivability at the beginning. I think that's what I'll do. We're on our last life. We can't make any wrong moves.
I want more activations on this thing, bro. I mean, we only need 14, though. Maybe we'll be okay? Or maybe I should move this down one. I mean, I could do this. But the fannies. Maybe it's okay. Maybe it's okay it's not inside the fannies. Yeah. Okay. Maybe it's okay. Let's see. <laughs> wow. Somebody had the exact, well, kind of the exact same idea. I think he's going for double Holy Spear. Double Holy Spear. That could be pretty interesting. Out of stamina is crazy, but I mean, that is a shield. That is a shield and we do hit twice. That was low-key like our free win. <laughs> Yes. Do I need this? Probably for Holy Spear. I need vampiric items. What am I doing? I definitely need vampiric items right now. Nah. <laughs> Rare footage of two Holy Spears, right? <laughs> Happens once every 50 years. Spikes here is gonna hurt from the from the thing, but there might not be a but. Hold up. Oh my gosh, the invulnerability saved us. Oh my gosh. This saved us so hard. Oh yeah, we need to get some vampiric items, and we're not gonna last much longer. Oh buddy. Where are they though? Like Thank you. I'm gonna need more than that. I'm gonna need more than that, but thank you. I don't know how I'm gonna get you. I gotta sell this. I gotta sell it. I don't think there's anything else I could have sold that made sense. Bro, the invulnerability from you saved me, my friend. You saved me. You procced at the perfect time, too. But now we got a lot more vampirism, which is great. A lot more healing, which is great. Crocking at the perfect time when this thing is doing most of its big boy hits and we win. Woo! So far, so good. Well, give me this. And we got another one of you, which is great. Um, I'll figure out where to put you in a minute. This will be fine. Um, okay. Oof, another one. We better win this next one. Maybe it's time for Vampiric Gloves, actually. I think it's time for Vampiric Gloves. I could get Vampiric Gloves this round. Yeah, let's try to do that. And for that, I have to move this down by one. Kinda. Um, let's reset, let's reset. We're resetting. So let's see here. This needs to go here. And I have to do this, this. Well, I guess technically I wouldn't have to do that. Maybe? Yeah, I do. Because I want to do that, and that way that still has that, you know? Everything is still looking good, basically. It's so far back, though. I don't like that. Maybe it'll be okay. And then that just goes there. And then this is all the way back here to get as many slots as possible in that. Just 
actually, maybe not. Maybe three slots is okay. Let's hope. <laughs> hope that three slots is okay. No, we're fine. We're fine. We can just do this. Yeah. And then we'll do that. And this can go right there. Alright, nice. Four slots on that thing. Armor means nothing to us. Debuffs mean nothing to us. We heal. Okay. <laughs> I unerratically tried to skip the rearrange. <laughs> oh, what am I going against? Hold up. An unhealing staff. Jesus Christ. It's already maxed out? Three prismatic orbs? Wow. I'm glad you don't have the unhealing staff now. I am so glad. I also like your placement. It's very visually stunning. I don't know if we win this. <laughs> this is scary. This dude's got a scary build. I feel like DPS wise, we out DPS, but they out heal us by far. By far they out heal us. And as soon as that they reach that 20 mana, bro. As soon as they reach that. Oh boy. Not to mention a triple prismatic orbs is gonna be a pain. Yeah. I think this is, I think we lose. <laughs> what just happened? <laughs> it's like their build just died as soon as it's procced. Their build just came into shambles. I was hyping your build up and this is all you have to show for it? It's okay. Maybe it's because you didn't have the unhealing staff. You know, you having the unhealing staff here is a whole different game. Whole different game. As soon as you get that bad boy, it's over with. Right? Right, Copium? Because what? How did we just win so easily? I kind of want some gems. I'm not going to lie. Ooh, moving this over here would be better. 35% faster in a prismatic orb does not sound bad. But then I lose the healing. My 8% healing. What's more important? <laughs> Probably the 35% faster, right? I think the 35% faster is more important. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I've seen this before. And I don't like how overpowered it is. <laughs> okay, well... We'll see what happens, I guess. Vamp potion! <laughs> Is it me or... <gasps> I just realized something. Holy shit. The reason we keep winning when this procs is because we become invulnerable and the bills that rely on life still to stay alive can't steal life because they're not hitting us and then we just kill them. <laughs> what in the world? Oh, wait, I misread it. I wonder if uh, Falcon Blade surrounded by totems could work. Need stamina. Re uh, regeneration, but that's a lot of empowerment really quickly. Oh, you mean just a bunch of totems surrounded by a falcon blade? That would be insane. Actually, we could try it one day. OMG, true? Yeah. So the build before, that's why that happened. And this build, why? Yeah. I told you, Holy Spirit is the new meta. <laughs> wow. And this is better than just having a regular crown because. Relic case increases its damage and you don't have to worry about block 
You don't have to worry about debuffs. You know? The only thing I would add on here is purple jewels. And that way it could destroy other people's buffs. And I would probably add... Yellow jewels on here, maybe? Possibly? It's too late to get jewels, though, I feel. Should I get this? I could get a corrupted heart. Why would I want a corrupted heart? I don't know. I'm gonna get it because it's on sale. Damn it. Is that more important? Probably. But what if we lose last next round? You know what I mean? What if we lose? I don't want to lose. Risk it. Actually, I could just sell space. I have so much space. I could just sell some space and get it. I don't know how good of a choice that was, but I did it anyway. Because <laughs> we were, were kind of looking good on space. Okay. This is a scary build. <laughs> this is like a Berserker burst build, low key. Double fencing, fencing rapier with a bunch of freaking pets, and they're definitely going to be critting like crazy. But then again, we heal. And we're going to be invulnerable. They don't heal. They're just damaged. They're just full-blown damage. I mean, they have block, though. They do have block. We'll see. We'll see what happens. But then again, Holy Spear. Block means nothing in the face of a Holy Spear. That hurt. Oh, guys. Are we okay? I need that invulnerability. Oh, I need it now. I need the invulnerability. Please, 14 gold. Please, 14 gold. I mean, not gold. There we go. Invulnerability procs. And block doesn't matter. You don't matter. Get out my face. I love it. Because, like, you don't build up too much mana too fast. You build it up at the right pace to proc this at the right time, giving the relic case enough time to give the Holy Spear a little bit additional damage. Boom. 100% faster. You're doing 24 damage per second. You're invulnerable. You're healing. You know what I mean? And you got Falcon Blade on the side helping you out. Finish at full HP. Exactly. I was a little bit scared there. But no, nah, this is actually low-key doing way better than I expected it to. And we're not even fooled out maxed out on this guy. Like, we need a whole nother prismatic orb. A whole nother one. Look at this. Damn it. I have regrets. Um, five percent after five seconds. Because I'll keep you there. You're the best! Thanks, man! <laughs> Wrong side. <laughs> you should have gotten the, uh, the blood side. <laughs> I'm surprised this is working, bro. Okay, this is a build we haven't gone against yet. A dragon build. Dun dun dun! Interesting choice using your oil lamp on the phoenix? Interesting? interesting to just not like move this over by one put this here put that up there you know what i mean interesting i mean he does have double <laughs> amulet's light a 40 percent increase in life stills insane we could have invested into something against like you know a little bit of defense items some helmets probably would have helped a lot with this build we have no helmets our only survivability is healing I just realized that we could we are definitely in the position to uh, invest into some, some helmets, I think. Oh, he came back alive. I thought the game was over. I think we're still fine. Invulnerability procs and dead. I think the only thing to make this build better is maybe 
maybe like get a blueberry or so just to increase because i feel like it might you know in these later rounds the invulnerability might be progging a little bit too late i feel like i feel like it's gonna be a little bit too late you know what i mean so getting like one blueberry might not hurt Second Holy Spear. <laughs> nah, you might be onto something, low key. I haven't even seen another crown though. But it is only a one stamina second. Like this doesn't use up stamina. It's a point four item, and this is a point six. Like you could definitely rock a second Holy Spear in this. I don't know how you would sort Nocturnal Locklifter though. I guess maybe just put it here in the middle, and put these oil lamps. Like you could do like two here, one here. Put a holy spear like right here and plus that'll be yeah you could definitely rock two holy spears and a falcon blade especially with the relic case that's very true i think we get this for defense for chance and then unique tri uh, trigger faster that helps out with holy spear and that's really about it i mean relic case and holy spear actually but and i guess prismatic orb too and we'll just put it here and then we could just that although i am kind of sad because i like my heart container to be on that guy but i guess it's okay i'm gonna buy one blueberry for the sake of what i said earlier we don't need you I think about it Would that be better to literally move holy spear right here for this build it'll be way faster huh wait a second if i were to do that we miss out on a lot of star slots though literally too well wait I could just move that back by one. I mean, when we miss out on one star slot, not the end of the world. Not as nice. It's not the end of the world. Figuring out this mana orb situation is going to be difficult, though. Uh, maybe it's not ideal. I would prefer to have two mana orbs if I'm doing this like this then at that point but it would be 30 percent faster which is very nice but i think i'm gonna switch it back <laughs> i do this nah these are inside of fannies i don't like that i like them to be inside of the fannies Could try it now. <laughs> nah, nah, nah. I don't agree too much. We'll just roll with this. And you know what? Why not? We can get a cap. Uh, how much gold? 15. That'll be 10. We'll have five gold left over. Push comes to shove. We'll just sell to heart container because I kind of do want another prismatic orb. I'm not going to lie. Thorns. Thorns and two shields might be our kryptonite. Holy shit, it is definitely our kryptonite. Invulnerability saved us here, and it still might not be enough. Holy shit, invulnerability saved us. Oh my gosh. Invulnerability saved us hard. We were definitely dead. Wow. Two shields and spikes is basically our kryptonite. Like... We are stun locked, and every time we hit, deal damage back to ourselves, putting poison on us. Wow, this is like our this is our counter build. I'm pretty sure. I can't think of another counter build, because we basically counter every build. We counter 
healing builds, debuff builds, super duper block builds, but we don't counter spikes or shields. Invulnerability, bro. The invulnerability helped so much. Oh, we actually don't need this. Um, we might keep that. Maybe magic armor it gives more consistent mana. Huh. That is a thought. You might be onto something. Actually, this build is stronger because every Chiromancer can't touch you. Oh yeah, because even Chiromancers can't touch. Exactly. Honestly, that might not be bad. And this is 12 gold, right? No, this is 14. So this will have to proc five times. Thought it'd be like 10 seconds. I don't know. Uh, nah. I think I like Mana Orb because Falcon Blade is a double trigger. I think that's better. Good looks, though. I want this. Can I get away with this? Hey, nice. Okay, well, this is uh, this is the build. <laughs> this went way better than I thought it would. Very surprisingly, way better than I thought it would. Even without that extra prismatic orb, getting that extra prismatic orb would have been way better. But yeah, Holy Spear and Falcon Blade actually works. You get your healing and your damage from Falcon Blade, and then like your defense part of your build basically just comes from a holy spear would love it if they made a sandbox mode to test out oh yeah for sure a sandbox mode would be would be really really nice okay looks like we got a blind build which we'll just counter that he won't do as much damage because i mean he's a blind build fancy and fancy rapier might be a problem though double heart container is interesting and i do not like the fact that his prismatic orbs aren't touching each other you fucked up. <laughs> All right, let's do it. Nine blind. Minus two. Minus four. Yep. And on top of that, we have freaking four oil lamps increasing the accuracy of this thing. So blind belts wouldn't be able to touch us at all. I don't I don't think I like the fact that we both procced that at the exact same time and like that. Twenty nineteen damage. This thing though, this is doing most amount of damage for him, for sure. But we just scale better, I think. Yeah. Doing two hundred damage per hit, bro. Ninety nine damage a second. Sheesh. And then, I mean, this itself is a blind counter. Like even without Holy Spirit, we would not be worrying about blind. I think Holy Spirit did help with the invulnerability though. Cause while this thing was invulnerable, we weren't going to be able to heal with Falcon Blade. So the fact that we proc invulnerability at the same time probably helped us out a lot. Cause while they're invulnerable, we're not healing or dealing damage. And they could just kill us. Pretty much just how we killed the other two builds, right? So having this here helps. Even if we just had the glowing crown there, it would have helped. 